The Gender, Intimacies and Sexuality Research Stream of the Citizenship and Governance SRA is interested in how we live, experience, understand, make sense of and are governed through our personal lives. And so because of the focus on gender and sexuality, it often means we're looking at the most intimate and personal experience that people have. So we're kind of sneaking into people's private lives, behind their closed doors perhaps, but also into public life to think about what people are doing in terms of their personal circumstances, in terms of how they experience their identity, about their sense of self. And so in that sense, we're looking at the way the macro and the micro dimensions of our lives intersect, how we are impacted by government policy or cultural attitudes to um, sexuality, to gender, and the way we actually then manifest those within our own experience, but also make sense of ourselves. So Genius Research is very much interested in how do we actually live our lives through these um, intersecting cultural norms, policy, practice, um, government um, legislation, through biography? So how our families feel about ourselves, and about our lives and the relationships, how we've grown up and what that does in terms of making us behave in particular ways as we go forward in our own lives. So it might be that we are thinking about partnership, we're thinking about parenthood, we're interested in probing how sexual orientation, for example, may seem something which is quite natural to some people, but actually it's also experienced in particular cultural circumstances and occurs in particular geopolitical contexts. So in the UK, we have particular partnership rights, particular parenthood rights, which we may take for granted now, which weren't the same 10 or 20 years ago, and they're certainly not the same in other parts of the globe. Other recent strands of work are looking at um, LGBTQI experience of young people, for example, and mental health and well-being. We know mental health of young people is something which is topical in the, the newspapers, but is something which is often misunderstood about how young people experience themselves and the impact of what it means to be outside the heteronorm, to live outside cultural registers which say there are certain ways of being and experience school, for example, where you may experience homophobia, to grow up in families where there are certain attitudes which may not mirror your own sense of self as a LGBTQI young person. And another example would be research that's being completed by colleagues in criminology, which is looking at the experience of trans prisoners within the penal system and more widely within the um, social environment. <music>